So this is the brand new Nvidia app and if you own an Nvidia card then this is going to be a must install for you. This is still in beta version but from my testing I find it a great and a major update from the previous the Nvidia experience app and this is how it looks this is you can check out all your system information from here you display CPU and everything I have the 1650 the GTA 1650 and it seems like it is well supported here now in the home page you will find all your games that are listed in the library and for individual game you can actually set the all the settings like graphic the shader the texture and uh, the window mode and everything and all of these just applies to your game so you can easily just change the settings from here and it will be applied or you can like choose the global options and then select and change the settings there and it will be applied to all of your games so that is also great and we have something called the artist dynamic vibrance uh, which i will show you later it's not supported in all of the uh, graphics card uh, but it is supported here so that is good and you can select the 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 v-sync and the latency mode and everything and all of these settings were available previously in this control panel and we still have this you can also open it from the settings and but uh, i think in future this app will be uh, like phased out and we will only have one single nvidia app for all of these settings and because most of the average users uh, this app is kind of complicated to use so I think uh, this will replace that also the main issue with the GeForce Experience app was the you had to sign in or log in to update your drivers but now you can use it without even logging in with your account you only need to log in if you want to redeem the coupon codes that we have available right now for any exclusive games so that is a really big advantage here we also have these uh, additional extensions that you can install if you want to uh, they're not that much helpful but uh, you can do that so this is blood strike a battle royale game and you can simply press the alt plus z key to open up this then brand new nvidia overlay app and you can customize the heads up display that is for your fps counter and your cpu temperature and everything so now we do not need any uh, third party application to achieve this feature you can also record high quality gameplays and also take screenshots and uh, we also have something called the game filter which is really great so it uh, uh, we can easily change the colors and the vibrancy of your gameplay without going to your game settings just using this nvidia app you can check out the yellow colors how they respond to it so this is really great and uh, it's not maybe supported for all of the graphics card but if it's supported on my 650 it should be supported on most and uh, not all of the games will be supported so this is a gameplay that i recorded earlier and if you use obs you need to manually set the uh, uh, change the settings for the downscale filter or something to achieve uh, any kind of if you want to reduce any kind of blurry uh, the blurriness from your gameplay uh, so i'm going to play this gameplay footage that i recorded using the nvidia app and uh, fast forward i want to tell you that uh, you, you do not get any kind of blurriness during uh, any kind of rush gameplay that you usually get if you use obs studio if you have not done any kind of manual settings um, so this is really great for beginners or the if you just want to record gameplays and it also has functionalities like it's going to automatically uh, record your last 30 seconds if you uh, if you have supported games it can also automatically record gameplays if you do double kill or triple kills so this is kind of really uh, advanced recording options that you get so a lot of features for the gamers out there now here i'm going to show you how the the game filters look so if i change the intensity mode for the rtx the vibrance you can check out the sky and the the ground the color they look much much more saturated and if you're supported game and supported graphics card you will get much more uh, filters option but here i'm just limited to one uh, but with this only i can this option is not available in the game so it looks uh, a kind of very vibrant and colorful so i think if you have a supported graphics card you will get much more options Yourself. 
So that was the new Nvidia app and if you have an Nvidia card I would highly recommend that you install it and use it as it is going to improve your gaming experience much better. So that was it for this video and I'll see you in the next one. Thank you for watching.